Greetings, fellow seekers of enlightenment. As a Buddhist monk, I would like to share with you a powerful quote from the Buddha. Just as a single creeper strangles the tree on which it grows, even so a man who is exceedingly depraved harms himself as only an enemy might wish. This quote is a warning about the dangers of depravity. It means that just as a creeper plant can strangle and kill a tree, so too can a person's depravity strangle and harm him or herself. When we act in harmful ways, we are essentially harming ourselves. This is because our actions have consequences, and negative actions can lead to negative consequences. So what does this mean for modern life? It means that we need to be mindful of our actions and how they affect ourselves and others. We need to be aware of our thoughts, words and deeds, and how they impact the world around us. We need to strive to act with kindness, compassion and wisdom in all that we do. When we act in harmful ways, we not only harm ourselves but also those around us. We create negative karma that can follow us for lifetimes. When we act with kindness and compassion, we create positive karma that can lead to happiness and well-being. So how can we apply this quote to our daily lives? We can start by examining our actions and motivations. Are we acting out of anger, greed or delusion? Or are we acting out of kindness, generosity and wisdom? We can also reflect on the consequences of our actions. Are we harming ourselves or others? Are we creating positive or negative consequences? By being mindful of our actions and their consequences, we can overcome our depravity and create positive change in our lives and in the world around us. We can become more enlightened and compassionate beings, spreading love and kindness wherever we go. Remember, just as a creeper can harm a tree, so too can our negative actions harm ourselves and others. Let us strive to act with kindness, compassion and wisdom in all that we do, so that we may create a more peaceful and harmonious world for all beings.